hello friends i am vikran singh and today i will show you how to call procedure from bert so let's start firstly we have to go open eclipse and then go to file and new you have to go for new report <coughs> then next blank report and finish this is the our screen for the creating report and we have to select data source from where, from where we get data sets new data source and uh, classic model in sample database here next finish we provide connection to the our data set which is uh, used to in data set here we using uh, we are using mysql jdbc driver 5.1 so we select driver class this and for database url <coughs> the database url is the path where our file exist so the path we can just search here driver class for my sql and <coughs> the driver class for my sql is uh, this the copy here and uh, just copy this report and go to eclipse they are based database url it is the path of your database and uh, what is the name of your database it is demo phone username root password Checking the connection is this connection established or not? Okay. Here, my data set is connected, and then we have to take the data set, new data set. Here, we have to call SQL procedure, stored procedure. So we select here a stored procedure here. Then next. and the stored procedure we have created <coughs> i will show you the stored procedure we have created a stored procedure here is the stored procedure which i have created for to update the username and the user id will be given from the user and after updation it will show the output of the updated user and the full table okay as uh, so procedure name is our procedure name is update this is our procedure name update value one so call stored procedure update value one and the parameters are basically defined that is username and password which are given by the <coughs> user so we take this it is used for to take input from the parameters and finish there are all the sets are started and we have to take parameters Are we okay? Just, just define some par two parameters to input. Two parameter. Here we want to update new user name. New user name. Data type string. Okay. 
and uh, another parameter for ID which is used to select the ID it is integer type ok again go to data set go to parameter and uh, input here the username is type string type and it is connected to new username yes ok and here it is connected user id is connected to user id id ok and select ok just just go to palette and take a table five cross Anything you take and select the data set, select all, finish. Now just drag and drop the data set into the table. User ID, username, first name. gender whatever you want to show just drag and drop and password go to preview it will just ask for the parameters that uh, I want to change the uh, my username as v k v i k r a n t 005 as on the id number 2 let's check the result that is it takes input as we can become 0 to 5 which we have taken again just check our result preview we want to take <coughs> ris which we see 0 0 5 on 1 ok is just changed to this is 005 this uh, username is stored on 3 and now change the value of the username on 3 just check again go to layout and again preview there we insert user 3 on third is this change okay guys thanks for watching